Yo, what's up guys? It's almost here. This Saturday, we're releasing US and EU 10X servers. Also for some non-solo online content, head over to my other channel, CM Gaming. So we know these guys have five SAM sites on the top as well as a bunch of auto turrets guarding the first floor. Near the inside of the walls, I wanted to take my C4 and like set down in there, but it looks like the auto turrets are going to stop me from doing that. So these guys had the entire island like walled off and they had external TCs all around the center. It was actually pretty difficult to find a spot to put my raid base. But I want to go ahead and try to bring some grenades to deal with these turrets. And we do have 40 C4 to try to raid this thing with. This turret's actually off. And there's one single armored wall, kind of sketchy there. So it looks like somebody rocketed this thing from afar and they came out here and repaired it with an HQM wall because it's not actually decaying. We might be able to get into the top of this thing for cheap. Let's check out the top. So yeah, we're in here for free and there's open doors here. Sheet door though. Okay, and it's sealed off 10 C4 completely down the drain. After not being able to find any good pathway to go down up there, I'm gonna cut my losses on those 10 C4 and come around to a door. Let's try his door path. And I'm guessing if we go in here, we can skip some of the doors. Yeah, here we go. I think that was pretty good. We killed a turret too. Oh no, this is going up. We're going straight into this armored wall. Okay, that was close. It is looking to me like there's no cheap way to do this. We're coming back with rockets and a bit more C4 and putting these grenades away. Didn't even need to take out a turret. So we'll see what we can make happen with some rockets. Um, I'm just not sure which way to go on this base. There's some half floors here, but there's a full wall here and the trap. Okay, nothing yet. 
Keep on rocketing. So only 10 rockets left on me. Switching back to C4, but it looks like these could be some sort of loot rooms. I mean, so many half walls in one spot. Nothing yet. TC? What the heck? It's like completely open in here. It's DK? Was this thing actually raided? I guess that would explain the outside, but looks like there's some boxes over here. That is pretty nuts though, 100,000 metal upkeep per day. And it looks like it might have been hit. Yeah, these are completely empty. We're down like over 40 C4 already too. You know, there's a door here though. Looks like these guys totally cleared this thing out. Shotgun trap facing to this wall. We've got a half floor here. Could always possibly be a loot room. And we've got a loot room here. Six boxes? Box of AKs? Two boxes of AKs, L96s, more AKs, and an actual sleeper? With a note. Hey Rust Academy, I love you. How did, how did he know I was gonna rate this, bro? More AKs. Five, six boxes full of AKs, but no sulfur. So it looks to me like the Raiders found the C4 and the rockets and all the sulfur from the TC because that looked like where the Raiders replaced it and left with that. But we're going to be leaving here with six entire boxes of AKs, but no C4 really to show for it. I mean, he had some mats in here. Um, this door kind of gave it away to where the loot would be. So he puts his loot behind the doors, but it's sealed off. Possibly could be a loot room there. Um, really don't have enough C4 to do another one. Well, I'm definitely going to be able to PvP for days, but that's going to be the end of raids for this wipe. Unless I can find some sort of jackpot from a smaller base using 64 and seven rockets, which I doubt. But hey, with the four swipe this week, it was kind of a weird schedule. Hopefully next wipe, we can get a little bit luckier with these raids.